kono niku tiny team and friends i so chamele ma boy na ma boy na chal Southern Africa and the five or six countries that surround Zambia are really the heart of the HIV epidemic. All the prevalence rate here in some communities is as high as 25 percent or higher. That's one in four people. I've seen a lot of progress in the eight years that I've been here. Hundreds of thousands of people now are getting treatment that have put the HIV virus to sleep for them. Their immune systems have been restored to close to normal. They're living essentially normal lives, living positively with their virus. Hinari was founded over a decade ago to bridge the information gap in health. It was soon joined by three other Research for Life programs, Agora, Oare and Adi, to provide free or low-cost access to critical research in health, environment, agriculture and innovation from leading scientific publishers. I could walk into any medical library in the world and have access to any medical journal. When I moved to Zambia, that just completely stopped. The mail service is slow. It was impossible for me to look at the journals that I needed to find the information. I think it was a little bit difficult for us to access the information. Mm -hmm. Being a non-government organization, I think we are not supported so much. Uh, we are benefiting so much in Hinari because I think most of the way we manage our patients, I think we usually go back to Hinari and then we do a research and then get the information. More than 8,000 peer-reviewed journals and 7,000 online books and databases are available through Hinari alone. This is said to be the biggest step ever taken towards reducing the health information gap between rich and poor countries. Hinari for us has been a real game changer. Three or four of our programs here are based on medical articles and best practice medicine that's resulted from reviews of the medical literature and that'd be impossible for something uh, for us without something like Canary. Well this is uh, I think I can say probably by uh, like I think for the pediatric um, HIV management is quite uh, dynamic it keeps on changing so most of the information that we're using we got it from Canary.